Hi everybody, Brian from Water Control checking in. You know, water can be downright mean when it doesn't have a properly balanced pH level. Speaking scientifically, the pH scale, which ranges from 0 to 14, is a measure of the concentration of hydrogen ions in a water-based solution. Now, speaking more practically, it's a way of measuring the acidity or the alkalinity of a solution. In the world of water treatment, the pH of the water in a home or facility can give us a good indication of just how corrosive the water may be, and to some degree, how likely it may be to cause scaling and mineral buildup in plumbing systems. Perfectly balanced water has a pH of 7.0, which makes it neither acidic nor alkaline. Any pH value below 7.0 indicates acidity. The lower the number, the stronger the acid. On the other hand, any pH value above 7.0 indicates alkalinity. The higher the number, the stronger the base. Clearly, acidic water is a problem. It corrodes piping, valves, fittings, and equipment. Problems can start when pH falls below 6.5. Problems will be significant when it falls below 6.0. Alkaline water can also be corrosive, particularly if the pH rises over 9.5. More commonly though, alkaline water is indicative of high levels of bicarbonates in the water. Bicarbonates can include dissolved molecules containing calcium, like hardness, right? Potassium, magnesium, iron, and more. High levels of bicarbonates can lead to scaling of fixtures and boilers and heat exchangers and more. Unfortunately, softening the water does not solve the issue. If you recall, a water softener simply takes calcium bicarbonate and transforms it into sodium bicarbonate. So in order to deal with the bicarbonates and the scaling they cause directly, we require a different type of ion exchange media. This particular media still regenerates with salt. However, it's the chloride and not the sodium that adheres to the media. And when treatment occurs, the bicarbonates are exchanged for small amounts of chloride. These ion exchange units are commonly known as dealkalizers. Acidic water is relatively easy to deal with. Typically, the water is run through a filter that looks like a water softener, but without any salt tank. Now, the media in that tank is calcite. Basically, it's limestone. It actually adds a small amount of hardness to the solution, to the tune of about four to six grains. And it neutralizes the acid in the process. If this low level hardness is problematic for your application, a water softener can be installed downstream. It's also possible to deal with pH issues via the injection of certain chemicals, such as acetic acid or soda ash solution, or others. These systems involve simple chemical injector pumps which treat the water as it enters the facility. If you have pH or scaling issues in your home or your facility, please contact Water Control for an expert who will help you with some high quality water treatment solutions.